What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back at again with another video. So, apparently, the rumors are circulating that Ricochet has not decided to um, renew or extend um, his contract with WWE. A lot of y'all were sending it to me on Twitter, so we're gonna check this out, see what's going on there. I know his contract was ex uh, set to expire, I believe last week or i think it was like last week or at some point and uh, i don't think he's reached a uh, uh some type of compromise for a new deal not sure how true it is but that is what's going on right now that's the rumor we're gonna check this out real quick see what's going on here um uh the report is ricochet is leaving wwe when his contract is up He's gone according to a new report. It was just over um, one week ago that report started going around that Ricochet is one of the many WWE stars with a contract uh, coming due. The word was he would uh, be uh, become a free agent later this summer. Earlier today, uh, my man Sean Reuter uh, passed along word spoiler alert of an intriguing title change uh, that was taped for WWE speed it involved none other than Ricochet himself who dropped the title to Andrade I did see that uh, someone had sent me the image of it uh, of him uh, Andrade becoming a new WWE speed champion which honestly if the rumors are true, it would make sense that he would drop the title before he heads out of WWE. Um, it involved none other than Ricochet himself, who dropped the title to Andrade. That was enough to create even more intrigue surrounding his status with the company. Now, PW Insider is outright reporting that Ricochet has told those in charge he intends to leave WWE when his contract comes up. The expectation now, uh, they say, is he will be written uh, written out of storylines rather quickly of late he has been uh, running up against Braun Breaker who has been booked to be a new uncontrollable monster on Monday Night Raw this sets up rather nicely to run another segment where Breaker sends Ricochet packing for good and perhaps Will Ospreay will get his wish to work with Ricochet once more TikTok yeah it, 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 it's it's looking that way if he's dropping the speed uh wwe speed championship and they're doing some angle with him and ricochet um with uh braun breaker and ricochet i can see a situation where uh braun breaker at some point pretty much packs up ricochet packs him up out of the wwe this is very unfortunate only because it's one of those situations where ricochet is a, a very great talent and him coming out of NXT, WWE, especially Vince McMahon, they didn't really utilize him as he should have. He had some some moments, but he 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 was only his he was only gonna get to the mid card. No nothing past that. And it didn't help that, you know, his promo skills aren't the best either. So, you know, Vince only just looked at him as this talented high flyer and, and that's about it he had some decent feuds here and there won a few mid-card championships but it nothing really stuck and when um triple h started taking over creative yes he started to give him a little bit more of a push and uh you know a little bit of momentum but it I'm be honest with you triple h really didn't do much with him either outside of giving him some more wins i mean ricochet i wouldn't say he was considered a jobber but he was considered like a talent that could potentially get someone new over. But, you know, he wasn't going to job out to that person. Um, he had his jobber moments, but he was never really positioned as someone that management was really trying to push this this high flyer with these exciting moves. Like they loved it and the crowd loved it. but it 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 does hurt when you have this wrestler that the crowd can get behind but they don't win substantial feuds and it doesn't help that their promo skills are to be desired it could be better um it, it sucks it really does it, it really does um i hopefully he is able to find something i'm sure i'm willing to bet uh you know aew is definitely going to be calling 
Um, the question is, if he does go to AEW, will that be the best for him? That's the real thing. Will that be the best for him? Because I feel like, and someone that made this point, in WWE, Ricochet is very unique. He is. That's why it worked, because the fans could get behind his moveset and, and exciting moves, but it's just they, you know, he wasn't really the guy to win majority of his feuds, so it was just like a, uh, like his, in my opinion, uh, one of his better feuds that I was hoping they were really going to extend was with Logan Paul, but they were one and done. They didn't really extend it, and that was it. Um, but someone had made the point that he's very unique in WWE because of his move set. You don't really see too many people doing the high fly move set like he does as well as he does. But if he does go to AEW, it could be a situation where he may get lost in the shuffle only because there are a lot of other individuals that do the same thing or similar things that he does. Do I think he can have some stellar fire ass matches? Yes, I do. But at the same time, I don't know. I'm 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 very I'm very indifferent to that because I don't know if they're going to if Tony is going to utilize him the way he he could be utilized. Granted, it may be better if he goes to AEW because you may actually see him on stream actually winning some matches and, and winning against important people. So who knows? Maybe that would be the best for him. I'm, I'm kind of indifferent to it. I'm on, I'm on the fence with it because, you know, w, uh, AEW's track record when it comes to getting WWE talent and bringing them over hasn't been the best, just, just to be honest with you. So I don't know. I don't want him to get lost in the shuffle. But, but if they do plan on using him in a prominent role and giving him some wins and, and, and you know, putting him in some high-profile matches, I'm okay with that. You know, I wouldn't trip if he went to AEW. Maybe he ends up going somewhere else and making a, a, a bigger name for himself. Who knows? But um, ultimately, I, I can't get mad at his decision for leaving. Because at the end of the day, he, I think he's reached his ceiling in WWE right now. They don't really have anything for him, even under Triple H's uh, uh, control right now. They don't have anything for him. Him going back to NXT doesn't really do anything for him. Um, they're, and they're obviously trying to push more of their younger talent and newer talent, I per se. Um, so, honestly, I understand. I, I wish nothing but the best for Ricochet. If this is all true, wish nothing but the best for him. We'll see if he does end up in AEW. Should be very interesting uh, how things will play out for him going forward. Comment down below. Let me know. Do y'all feel like Ricochet will go to AEW if the rumors are true that he isn't resigning with WWE? Do you feel like he'll, he'll go to TNA, uh, New Japan? Where do y'all feel like Ricochet will go if his contract uh expires in wwe appreciate all the love and support y'all have shown on channel road to 50k and i'm still gonna speed the youtube wrestling champ of the world appreciate y'all kicking with me see y'all next one peace